doll hobbyists. Have you been interested in making a wig lately but are not sure where you should begin? I have just the thing! Ta-da! It's called Make Your Own Wigs for BJD and any other doll. Which means it doesn't matter what kind of doll you have. I'm pretty confident that all the techniques in this book will help you get started on whatever. It doesn't matter. I personally like BJDs. They're right here behind me. Uh, so, so that's kind of what I use within the book. But if you have a, a Monster High or a Barbie or anything or even a big retail mannequin, something really big, then that's fine. You can um, check out this book and read all about it and maybe make a wig for your special doll. I cover about three ways to make a wig. You know, there's, there's two ways and then you can hybrid them together and you can kind of mix and match and I, and I try to help you to kind of think of ideas. You know, I got some ideas but, but I also want to challenge you to come up with your own ideas because it's all about creativity and trying to just make it happen. Just, just brainstorm and just make it happen. So, so there it is. It's, it's out. It's a brand new book. It's available on Amazon.com and um, probably everywhere else too. It's, I've just recently uh, made it go live over the internet. So it might take a little bit of time to, to process through to your favorite retailer. So if you don't see it at first, keep checking back and you'll probably see it in, in good time. But, uh, but you will definitely see it on Amazon pretty fast. <laughs> if not already, it's on there. So, so there it is. Here's a, here's a brief glimpse. We, uh, I focus mostly on um, natural animal hair. Uh, which uh, especially angora mohair and alpaca hair and I will teach you how to wash the hair and comb the hair and then I'll teach you how to make the wig cap base and then I will teach you how to attach hair to it and um, and I've got some special special things going on too just I, I got my own special projects I, I shared my my journey and uh, there's a there's also a frequently asked questions uh, section uh, from which is basically is based on questions people have asked me in real life so so I tried my best to kind of make it easy to understand and and cover a lot of um, ideas and questions that people might have so anyway just check it out I'm gonna stop rambling for now and and just give you a chance to just uh, you know go take a look and see what we got going on Alright, thanks for watching. Happy crafting!